Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 16, I think. I think it's like episode 6 for me. Um, I actually did kind of vlog the last two days, but I didn't upload them because things were not the best. Um, which I'll touch on in a minute, but basically today I just have lots of errands to run. Lots of like Christmassy things as well as lots of like mostly moving things honestly but I also want to make sugar cookies so that's fun um I also need to pack because I'm going to Dublin tomorrow my family are like currently in Dublin so I'm just gonna follow them there I needed to get some stuff done here and also kind of um it's hard because my parents are like especially my mom is like super stressed about the whole thing but she's like trying to pretend she's not stressed and it's just making things worse so um yeah basically the last two days have been a little bit rough i had housing housing fell through and then i had to spend the whole day looking for new housing which i did and i found something and then i facetimed a person and then i wired her money so I have a place to live now. I'm not like 100% woohoo excited about it, but I have a place. Yes, my hand is completely different color to my face. Pale girl problems. Um, so I have a place to live now until the 31st of March, which is great because, you know, hopefully at that point I will have a better idea of where I want to live. Um, so I have a room until then. And then I just like got all wound up about not having a job and not being able to find anything that I could even apply to and it was just a mess. It was not a good time. Um, so I decided not to upload those vlogs. But today is going to be different because we have, you know, found the missing SIM card and, you know, we've done some of the stressful things and um, we are just gonna move on with the more new fun stuff. Um, I'll probably hang out with Rebecca as well today because she's home. Um, I did yesterday, but I didn't, um, at that point I had stopped vlogging because I was like, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. that was how I was feeling. So it's like basically the afternoon, but I've only just got ready and I'm going to have some breakfast now and get moving. So minor change of plans. I kind of have to run into town so I can run home, but I thought I would just show you what I'm wearing. I don't like how these boots look with this. But I don't have a re really have another option. I'm not wearing like runners and I have to go into town. So we have like, there's like a delivery or something coming to the house and I'm only on here. So I have to go run into the post office and organize this like card. Maybe I'll talk about it later. Um, <clears throat> or two of them. And then I have to activate a new bank card at an ATM, that should only take a second, and I need to get cash anyways. I need to, what's the third thing I need to do? Oh, I need to get something more for my dad for Christmas, because my dad is such a dad, and I was like, what do you want for Christmas? He's like, I want a new hat. It's like, okay, but I want to get him something else as well. I have the hat, um, and then something more for dad, and something more for my mom as well. So I need to, Run around. I'm gonna just consult my to-do list in my planner before I leave and then we will get into the good old town of Venice. I found a hat which really helps with this whole hair situation that I have going on today. Uh, natural hair also looks like good the first day and then just goes downhill from there. So I don't, I don't have my watch on. I don't know what time it is. Uh, it is 12.54. <sighs> I got a be walking back in like just over an hour oh god this isn't gonna work out well oh there's a delivery okay um yeah hopefully i'll be back in time maybe i won't be better just run um but yeah so i'm wearing this cute gray hat i think it's from i don't know it's from some irish network company i got it in the airport and then the coat i wore in london so it's my dog jingling away she's like a cat Okay, to town we go. I'm back from town now. Sparkles, just my dog. Um, hang with the tree, but uh, that was as 
was actually more stressful. I was like, okay, I'm gonna get these things done. And then, you know when like advertising, like false advertising, where it's like, just pop into your local branch and we can figure this all out. Not true. Um, basically, I needed proof of address. Like it makes sense. But like, could you warn me? Uh, I need proof of address. I had my ID with me and then the way I was going to like, so basically the whole like bank thing was kind of fine, but I had to go back to the bank and I was able to get the presents that I still needed. Like they were just like little bonus presents. But so what I was trying to do was there's in like our post office kind of, yeah, like our post office, but like you can do some sort of some level of banking there and things like that. Um, a lot of people have, it's like a state savings account at the post office. So I've had one since I was really small, like a lot of people with their communion money and confirmation money, that's where some of it will go. So I was always like that as well. And I have a good bit saved in there and I was going to use that, that was always like for when I was in a stage, would you stop panting please? It's not hot. It was always kind of for a stage of life like this. So um, I was going to use some of that money to put on they have like these like prepay debit cards that you can get in any currency and they're like um what's what i'm looking for commission free so there you go uh post effects commission free multi-currency card so basically i would be able to get commission free dollars of a certain amount on this what is a debit card it's a it, behaves like a MasterCard um, and you can use it anywhere that accepts MasterCard um, for moving so I was going to put like for all the like expenses that are coming along with it like I'm gonna have to buy like bedding and towels and um, like maybe some housewares and you know that kind of stuff so then they were like just go across to the bank and they'll print a statement for you with your proof of address and I said okay cool so I went to the bank and they were like no we can't do that you need to go home and do that after me printing like a bajillion things at the bank and being like, none of these have my address on it. Can you print the one with my address on it? So I've just printed it now, put it in my bag. The thing is that I won't be able, like there, also I was gonna like film a clip in the post office. There were like a million people in there, like a quarter of this country's population. And I was just like, somebody smelled of BO and it was so hot and it was, didn't help with the crankiness. So, I'm back home. Don't just calm down a small bit. And I'm seeing if maybe Rebecca wants to come over and make sugar cookies, cause that'd be fun. And my hair is such a greasy mess. But, yeah. So I'm gonna have to do that like, whatever day I don't go to see my other grandmother. Cause I don't know if I said this before, I'm going to Dublin tomorrow. I'm going to Dublin um, at 10 a.m. tomorrow on the train to see my grandma before I leave. My grandma's 97, which is crazy. But um, yeah, I need to see her before I go and then I need to see my other grandmother. I have two living grandmothers um, and like obviously my other extended family. She's in Waterford, she's in another place completely. So um, I'm going to come home on Wednesday. Hopefully I'll try and do it like Wednesday afternoon. That would be the best thing because then I would have like Thursday, Friday, Saturday free. Um, and yeah. It's just one of those things where it's like, this is hard enough. If everything was going smoothly, this would be really difficult. But when there's these hurdles in your way, it just makes it that much harder. But I'll see if Rebecca wants to come over, play with me. If not, I'm just gonna make sugar cookies by myself because I need sugar right now. And yeah, I'm just gonna get this filled out again. Um, but yeah, they weren't gonna let me transfer money from my post office savings account onto this. I would have to like withdraw the cash and then put that cash on, I think. Or else I could do it through my debit card, but I've, I'm paying rent through my regular Irish debit account and I don't necessarily want to do that because I... <sighs> Anyways, sugar cookies will help if I can get them. I just self tan, don't I look cute? I didn't like properly wash off my eye makeup, but like my eyebrows are gone and everything else. 
but as you saw, I made sugar cookies. Sorry, I just ran up the stairs. Um, and I iced them when Rebecca was here. She came over for a couple of minutes. Basically, my brother and I just got takeout pizza. I got a major spoiler with my Christmas gifts from my parents because there was a package to be picked up. It was like, they couldn't, there was nobody here. There was like, nobody here for about 20 minutes, 15 to 20 max. Today, when I was walking into town, I met my brother walking home from town and they tried to deliver it then. It would have been so good if Garvin was able to like, get it and put it away but we went to go pick it up and my mom was like don't actually don't go pick it up and I was like we're, we're already on the way she's like they don't want you to see who it's from I said okay I won't look but they have their freaking name all over the packaging and like it's a company that does one thing so I was like oh, okay and then I was like moving it and the color was right in front of me and I was like damn it but so it's very exciting so I don't really mind so yeah obviously i self tanned but if it looks a little weird i don't know if you can tell in this lighting um if you fake tan you probably know that if you're using like a mousse or i think most of them are doing do this but i know especially with mousse like cocoa brown is what i prefer to use it goes green when it goes off and it like slowly goes until it's like green so this is like green ish but I used it anyway, so I'm honestly, I don't know if you can tell, I'm like proper green tinted, it's not the lighting. I don't really care, to be honest, it's not, it doesn't stay green. Um, I think it's more so the like application color that is. Uh, anyway, it's one hour tan, so I just leave it on for like two hours. You can leave, leave it on between one and three. I've, I usually sleep in it, but my sheets are all beautiful and white, so I don't want to. Um, but it is one hour tan technically, so. I'm just gonna shower it off in a little while. But basically I just kinda need to tidy up my room again. I think I'm gonna watch some Riverdale. Maybe do a little bit of planner stuff. I don't know. I need to wrap some Christmas presents. That's what I'm gonna do now. Just little extra things I picked up today in town for my parents. Um, yeah, I also bought a new purple shampoo. Actually, I'll show what I bought in town. So, You've probably seen, especially in recent pictures, my hair, I br it's like super dirty and I brushed it out to kind of like spread the oil through it. I know it's really gross, but my hair goes so brassy. Apparently it's because of the water where I live, as well as just my dad has red hair naturally. So that's where like my mom obviously has root. If you've seen her before, I don't know if she's back there somewhere. She has really, really dark hair and she tans super easily. I got the ginger jeans. Um, so I got, I didn't, I was trying to avoid buying it because I moved so soon, but like, I can't. Um, so I bought new purple conditioner. It's the ultraviolet, like, toning ultraviolet conditioner. So it's like the stronger one, max strength. So I haven't actually opened it to see how purple it is, but um, because I have balayage, like, these are my natural roots but then it just gets really yellow looking down here. So um, I'm going to try and tone those today. Then I also bought Batiste Volume Dry Shampoo because I was like, again, trying not to buy dry shampoo, but then my hair keeps getting super dirty. And especially now we're gonna be, I'm gonna be like visiting family starting tomorrow morning. Um, I don't want to have like gross hair, you know, even if, I'm, if I have natural hair. I want to be able to put the volume back in it. So I got this one, but now I see it says with plumping collagen. So I guess this is vegetarian. And I know you're not eating it, but like, that's gross. I'm gonna Google that, but I haven't smelled it or anything either. So have a relaxing and with a little bit of productivity kind of evening. So first off, Riverdale is crazy this season. I don't understand it. My brother has never seen it before. He was absolutely pissed himself laughing the whole time. Um, I just watched the last two episodes. But I'm currently, like, it's like avoid the mess but find the dog. Sparkers. Um, I have the dog. She does have a bed in my room now, if you've seen those chronicles. Um, but she is being a little diva about going to bed. Sometimes she does this. Um, she throws an absolute tantrum, so. I'm letting her chill up here while I pack for going to Dublin tomorrow. Um, even though I really should be going to sleep, but I haven't packed yet, so 
um, she gets that privilege. So that is it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed. Things are kind of on the up. I was just by chance came across something today and it was saying that sometimes the way I'm acting at the minute and things like that, um, my hair has toned a little bit just on a completely different note but um, this is a big thing it's not a bad thing but big things take up a lot of space in your head and that can be hard so I think that's a good way of explaining it um, I need to go the fuck to sleep but I also have to pack and I like don't know what to wear you know when you want to look good but then you're like I have no clue story um some of my stuff it's not packed but it's in the other room then when i leave the dog's like but where are you going so have to watch for that too um and yeah uh, i also can't pull out my vera bradley which is the bag i always use for this because she'll start to get so angsty because she remembers it from me going up and down to college yeah that's it for today's video I hope you enjoyed if you did subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram because that's where i'm most active and i will see you in my next video